Good evening. Welcome to .programming.blogspot.com. Today I'm talking about how to design master page or layout page in MVC. So in previous video tutorials, uh, I have already explained about views uh, and how to take multiple views uh, in MVC. So today I'm talking about how to design master page for multiple views. Okay, uh, because the I want to set the single theme. Uh, for all uh, views so to design the master page for all so uh, I have a single controller that is home controller and so yeah now uh, the right clicking on the index method and add views only the single controller and uh, we have a uh, three different action method that is index about and contact uh, in the home page in the home views we have uh, index.cshtml page and that is the home page by default actually this is the web page in asp.net if you uh, if you take asp.net okay uh, that is the home page uh, you can put your home page content here okay this is the home page and build the project and also add a view for about action method this is the about page welcome to dot programming dot blogspot dot com uh, programming block it's a programming block if you uh, put your block by data into your page then simply edit now also add the view page for your contact and this is the contact dot html page facebook id http dab 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 dot facebook dot com so this is my blog uh, page that is dot programming okay now we have a uh, three uh, views and I want to set a single theme for all uh, for three views okay so the default page that is index page uh, render on the browser mm. in the view folder we have three page that is about contact and index but in the start page that that is the default theme is applied application name uh, black uh, background divisions home page so mm, I want to change the default theme and I want to set uh, my theme that is the page layout.cshtml page in the view folder sorry in the shared folder delete this page in the shared folder and also add a new folder in the shared folder add new page that is mvc layout page i want to set the layout of the all pages that is layout page one uh, that is i want to uh, put html table here from the html tool uh, yeah that is uh, in the default row and column of the table that is 3 by 3 so mm, that is a 3 by 3 table mm. the second row yeah 3 by 3 tables so 3 rows and 3 columns in each rows we have a 3 column so 
I want to put in the first column <coughs> uh, logo of the website uh, logo of the website that is the first row and the first column division around the table so cut and paste it here yeah website name in the second column of the first row in the third column of the first row that is sign in and sign up uh, here your first row is completed with the three text logo of the website website name and the sign up and sign in in the second row or the first column that is the left sidebar and the last that is right sidebar and the middle corner your body content where your all web pages are rendered and the last row for the bottom okay that is the uh, that show the footer row so in the last row the first column define the footer left footer middle and footer right corner this is your uh, that is your actual theme layout footer middle and the last one is footer mm, footer right okay now set the uh, theme of your MVC page now copy and paste the at the rate sign render body method at the rate sign render body method uh, here your web page or you can say the uh, views are rendered okay please uh, don't forget this uh, things that is uh, at the rate render body method because your all web pages are rendered here in the last column that is view start dot html page your first and uh, your default layout that is layout page one set it okay now your settings of the startup page mm, yeah that is logo of the website in the first row that is second row your home page you can put your home page content here that is your body and uh, that is your page contents that is the default index method run inside your theme okay in the layout page you can define it all clear if you want to um, put uh, your uh, list of menus then you put in the left sidebar okay like uh, at the rate dot I want to put uh, some links for all pages that is at the rest uh, HTML dot action link this hyperlink actually uh, discussed in earlier session uh, so watch my second or third video tutorials to learn more about hyperlink at the rate html dot action link the first link is, is the string uh, that is user defined that is home the second is a index method actually a action method and third for controller so uh, for the action link so here we have three uh, views that is home about and contact the first string that is for uh, string that is user defined and second for action methods that is second for about change about about and third for contact okay that's fine fresh it yeah 
uh, here we have three that is home page when we click on to about that is welcome to dot programming dot dot com and when we click to contact that is contact so thank you thank you very much for watching this video tutorial please keep watching my all video tutorials thank you thank you very much